what's up traders so for today we've got a nice five minute scalping strategy in this video i'm gonna talk about a new five minute scalping strategy that came across my path i'm curious about the uh, win rate and how good this strategy actually is um, enough said let's dive right in the video <laughs> All right, guys, first things first, let's add the indicators. So the first indicator that we're going to use is the horn pattern identifier from Lux. This one, add this one to your uh, trading view. You're going to see it on the top left. All right, guys, and the second one is going to be the G channel trend indicator. All right, capital G dash channel trend detection the g channel trend detection it was uh, it's from jagged soft shout out to you all right so first things first we've added the two indicators and what we're gonna do right now is gonna adjust the settings and tweak the settings a bit all right so now let's adjust the settings for the horn indicator for the horn pattern identifier the only thing you're gonna do is you're gonna remove the lines and that's that and for the g trend indicator what you're gonna do is you're gonna remove the shades and this is in essence how we're gonna trade this strategy uh, this is how it's gonna look now i'm gonna explain the long position and after that i'm gonna explain a short position uh, let's go of course i'm gonna backtest it a hundred times all right, guys, now first things first, let's explain a long position. It's quite easy. The first thing that we're going to need is that it's going to turn green. So what we're seeing right here, this is one of the two key components before we can take a long position. The other one is that we need a buy signal. Let's wait for that one. So that's a sell signal. Um, that's not going to be your short position when there is in the green. But we're going to need to wait for a green buy signal. There's the grind, there's our buy signal, guys. So what we're doing right now is here you can take your long position. Always wait for that confirmation candle. So we're gonna do this, and it's gonna be the wake low. So around there is gonna be our stop loss, and the risk reward is gonna be 1.5. Let's see how this plays out. All right, what we're seeing right now is that we are well above our target uh, take profit level so this is in essence a successful long position now i'm going to explain a short position let's go explain uh, the short uh, position it's vice versa for the long position so let's go what we're waiting for right now is that it turns the shadow is turning red so now it's almost green and of course all right it turned red what we're also waiting for is that sell signal that sell position and that's here it is always wait for that confirmation candle you saw it turning so this is where in essence you can take a short position all right let's take the short position what i've previously explained take the wig high or the wig low and take a risk reward of 1.5 so it's going to be around here and let's see how this plays out All right. Did it hit? No, it didn't it? Yes, it hit. So what we're seeing right now, guys, that we're in a nice profit. Uh, this is in essence a short position. Now I'm gonna back test it a hundred times and show you the results. Let's go. All right, guys, the back test was done and here are the results. The G-trend indicator put in on a position of level around level 20. 
Um, we did it on a five minute time frame. The risk reward was 1.5 and the trades that were taken were 100. The time it took to take these trades was 31 days. The most consecutive wins were five and the most consecutive losses were four. The win rate was 54% and the stop loss was at the swing high or swing low. The GOA was 4% and the GOA with 1% stop loss was around 35%. Again, this is a strategy that works worked out okay, but it wouldn't be my number one recommendation. That would be the Fumanchu strategy. All right, guys, this was it for today. See you in the next video. Thanks. Yeah.